Welcome to Early Morning Catechism. The title of today's lesson has been listed as O O O. What it really should be is O O O O O O O. As you can see, we are in the fourth week of Advent and all the candles are lighted. From the 17th of December through the 23rd is a very, very special week in the church year. And the O's that we talk about refer to the O antiphons. What's an antiphon? It's a one-line prayer. In the liturgy of the hours of the church, this one-liner, this antiphon, is before every psalm or canticle that we pray. There's also a, an antiphon before the canticle of Zechariah in the morning prayer, and an antiphon uh, before Mary's canticle in the evening prayer. During this week, before Mary's canticle in the evening prayer, the church has a prayer that always begins with the word O. And they're called the O antiphons then. And what are they? They're titles for God, titles for Jesus. They refer to the God of the Old Testament, and then we look forward to how that will be fulfilled in the New Testament. So let us begin. On December 17th, the church uses the title, O Wisdom. And we think of how the wisdom of God guided the Israelites of old. We think about the Holy Spirit and how the Spirit of God was so present in Jesus and how that same Spirit is present in the Word of God and is given to us in the sacraments. On December 18th, we talk about, O Lord of might, who on Mount Sinai gave to the people the commandments and entered into covenant with them. We think of the law of the Old Testament and how that was fulfilled in Jesus through his law of love. On December 19th is one of my favorite, O Root of Jesse. Who was Jesse? He was the father of David and Jesse lived in Bethlehem. At the time of Jesus, the line of David was now producing very weak kings, and the people longed for a king who would be like David. It seemed like the dynasty had died out. Jesus would be the shoot that would sprout from the stump of Jesse. He would be the blossom that would come forth. On December 20th, we refer to Jesus as the key of David. We think of how God would open wide the gates, the gates leading to heaven through the death resurrection of Jesus. On December 21st, the very first day of winter, the shortest day of the year, we refer to Jesus as the rising dawn. And the scripture reading for that day talks about springtime. On the 22nd of December, we call Jesus the King of all the nations. And finally, on the 23rd of December, the day before we begin the Christmas celebration, we refer to Jesus as God among us. God with us, Emmanuel. Now, if, if you want a really easy way to learn the O antiphons, I'm sure you can find a copy of the song, O Come, O Come, Emmanuel. It's all there for you. That's where those verses come from. They are the O antiphons.